What's up guys? Today we have a battle against a guy from the Smogon Battle Finder and uh, this was a pretty interesting match because he had hacked pokes. So looking from his team, uh, I thought Cloyster would be the best thing to lead off with because it can hit super effectively three of his six guys. So, you know, Cloyster is obviously the right choice. So he, uh, I do predict him to lead off with either Victini or uh, any of those other two. He does lead off with Victini and then I lead off with Cloyster. Now he attacks me first so that means he must be running max speed because Cloyster with max speed and uh, with a speed boosting nature reaches 262 while Victini without any speed investments only reaches 236. So uh, you know, uh, I know he's running max speed so I did I ran a damage calc and unless he's has max defense and max HP he wouldn't be able to live that rock blast and uh, he does so he has max defense max HP and max speed but well whatever I'm gonna switch out go into my uh, heat trend as he switches into his Suicune now this is a bad matchup for me so I have to switch out I'm gonna go into my Ferrothorn as he sets up a Calm Mind but that's fine, really. He can set up plus six for all I care. Um, you know, my Ferrothorn can take any of his hits. He does go for the Ice Beam, which does like a fifth. It's like, uh, it should be a, like a seven to eight hit KO after lefties. And I'm just going to go for the Leech Seed because I, I honestly thought he would go into his uh, Victini. But uh, he doesn't, so that's like whatever. But uh, he's going to switch out, and he's going to go into his Verizion now, and uh, I do predict that, and they go for the Gyro Ball, which is an easy 2-hit KO on Verizion, because Verizion is quite the fast poke with 109 base speed, and uh, Verizion is actually a pretty good poke, and uh, I use him a lot, and uh, he's pretty cool and stuff. So he's going to go for the, I don't even know what that move uh, was, Look, seems like growth, but with another name and uh, instead of switching out which I thought was kind of weird but you know that's his choice so now he's going to switch it to his Jirashi and uh, keep in mind that he wishes up right here so I'm like okay he has the wish and that uh, he's going to wish pass into his uh, Victini as I set up the rocks now I have to switch out because I'm fearing the fire type move and I am going to go into my Volcarona no I actually I just pull off the double switch because I knew he wouldn't stay in um anyways uh, I'm in with Volcarona I'm safe and uh, again he outspeeds my Volcarona who has max speed as well so he must be running max speed and a speed boosting nature so yeah, because I am running a speed boosting nature. Because most of my pokes run a speed boosting nature because I'd rather have speed than power, you know, how that goes. But uh, anyways, I am going to switch out. I'm going to just go for the bug buzz because knowing um, it wouldn't do much to his Victini anyways. But, you know, just to get off some nice damage, uh, I could start setting up uh, because I do have the rest so and the Chesto, so whatever. But uh, I'm going to predict him to do anything but... T-Wave, so I'm going to switch out into my Tirakion, and I'm going to go straight for the Stone Edge, predicting his Gliscor to come in. Now, I do hit the Glis incoming Gliscor with a Stone Edge, and I do get a critical hit. Now, that didn't matter much anyways, because um, obviously I can outspeed, unless he's running max speed with a, a like he is with his big TV and stuff. And uh, I do get a crit, which kind of didn't matter because I could have taken it out anyway, so it would have been a solid two-hit KO and stuff. And then now he's going to switch out into his Suicune. Uh, I knew he would calm mine, but I was afraid of Stone Edge missing, so I'm going to switch out into Ferrothorn. He does go for one calm mind, and here uh, I'm pretty sure he's not going to switch out, predicting me to go for the Leech Seed. So I am going to go straight for the Power Whip, knowing it's going to do a decent chunk to anything. Now wants to come in, consider his only resist is Victini, and uh, I am just going to go for it. He actually stays in, and that goes for another Calm Mind, which is perfectly fine with me, because unless he gets to plus 6, he won't be able to Oko me, and I'll be able to Revenge Kill with Power Whip. Unless I miss like 5 Power Whips in a row, so 
which obviously won't happen. Well, I thought, but uh, <laughs> you'll see what happens. He's gonna go. He's gonna hit me with an ice beam, and that's gonna do um, a little bit over a hundred damage. But that's fine because it's still a five hit KO after lefties. And I'm going to leech seed because I really thought he would switch out here. Because why would you stay in? I mean, you obviously have nothing to Oko me, even if he had like hidden power fire. -ups. But that's like the weirdest thing you have on a Suicune. But uh, anyways, I'm going to leech seed, and then now he's going to switch out back into his Victini as I go for the power whip now I do miss this first power whip which didn't matter much in the long run but uh, he's going to over predict me to switch out and uh, he's going to try to burn me but uh, he is going to miss the will wisp as I miss again the power whip now at this point he thought I would switch out that's why he on the next turn he goes for the T-Wave and uh, all these after turns effects are making me slow up on my narration. But uh, he's going to go for the T-Wave, he's going to hit it, and I am going to miss another Power Whip. And uh, again, I'm getting ahead. But uh, no, I missed the Leech Seed, I'm sorry. So basically that's three turns and uh, three misses, so that's luck is not really on my side this turn. But uh, he's just I'm going to leave Ferrothorn in to die. He is going to go for the Fire Blast. He does get a critical hit here. And uh, it does matter if uh, he is um, a bulky Victini, but judging from this guy, he probably has max special attack on this guy too, so I'm, I'm going to say it didn't matter. But uh, now I'm going to switch out to my Terrakion, knowing I can outspeed, and check this out. Uh, look, no, just, just look. He outspeeds me with Victini, and uh, I am banded with, I am jolly banded. So that means I have 346 speed. So even if he is running max speed with a speed boosting nature, he still wouldn't be able to have speed me. So he has Prankster on his Victini, which is like, what? That's so illegal. It's not even funny. But uh, at this point, you know, anything on his team will die to an earthquake so basically this is going to end up like a mini Taraki on sweep so that's kind of cool because his sweet is are pretty low so he won't be able to live a hit his Jirashi oh yeah now keep an eye on Jirashi keep an eye on Jirashi it outspeeds me so it's scarfed Jirashi but remember from before when I said check this out he went for wish so and I'm pretty sure Jirashi does not have trick so why just why? What are you doing, man? Not only are you a hacker, but you're a noob as well. That's that's funny. But uh, either way, he won't be able to take me out. And uh, his last guy is Blissey, which if it doesn't die to an earthquake, my cloister can just finish it off later. So he's just going to run to make things shorter. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Remember to leave a thumbs up and a comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.